dog. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, it is official. The, t the, the beauty school, cosmetology school vlogs, I'm going to bring those back weekly, okay, until I finish the program. Now, let me catch y'all up. Those of you who may not know, um, it's your girl Ty. Okay, welcome home, Angel. Do me a favor. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit that bell. Okay, so you can know every time we post because it's a lot that goes on on this channel, all right? Um, so, I am more than halfway through cosmetology school again for the second time. Um, I'm now attending Paul Mitchell's school. Um, I am in the last stage of that program. I am now a creative. I am uh, about uh, maybe about almost 1100 hours or so. Um, if I could give you a rule of advice, come to school every day, okay? If you don't have a business or family or anything that keeps you from maybe having to miss school, don't miss school if you don't have to, okay? So, um, I am in a full-time program, um, and yeah, I'm keeping it going. Right now, I'm scheduled to graduate, I want to say around July the 16th, okay? That's with the hours that I've missed. So, we're going to try our hardest to move that down with making up hours, but... Right now, it's around July the 16th, 17th. I'm scheduled to graduate. So that's about a week or so, a little more after my birthday. So, um, yeah. Today is um, day, what's the Tuesday? Morning? Today is Thursday. What's today's day? Let me tell y'all. So we might be in real time. Today is Thursday, April the 6th. Okay? And it's time for. <gasps> Oh my God, I feel so disappointed. Y'all ready for some jewels? I miss giving y'all jewels. I probably need jewels to myself, okay? It's life, it's life in, but I'm figuring it. No matter what, keep going, keep growing through, and keep showing up. But let's get into this jewel of the day. Ty's jewel of the day for today, April the 6th. Ooh. Don't let the bad days make you think you have a bad life. Don't let the bad days make you think you have a bad life. Because you're not. Keep going. You're not alone. I'm still on this journey. I'm two years in and I'm still on this journey. Still in. Keep growing through. You never know if you stop. Let's go. Hey angels and welcome back to Touch My Thai Hair Co. Today is day two of recording. Um, please don't judge me because you probably just watched yesterday and you realized that I only did my intro, okay? I didn't record anything. Guess why? Because there was nothing to record, okay? Yesterday was nothing to record. Did I have a client yesterday? No, I didn't even have a client yesterday. So today, ooh, excuse me. So today, is day two of recording, but Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, but Friday, day four of the week, okay? So I'm recording. Today is Thursday, April the 7th. I mean, Friday, April the 7th. Yes, Friday, April the 7th. Um, and let's get into <gasps> Taj Jewel of the Day. Taj Jewel of the Day for today. Hold on, that's my hand. Give me one second, because I'm holding my phone. Taj Jewel of the Day for today, Friday, April the 7th of 2023. Release what no longer serves you. Say it one more time for the people in the bike. Release what no longer serves you. When we hold on to things, it only hurts us. It only hurts us. So forgive, release, heal. You've got work to do. And it doesn't really matter how you feel because God is always and still ready to be praised. Amen? So I do have a client today. So I should be able to record a little bit. I'm late. Okay, I am late. But I already took my test. Okay, and I passed it. So let's get in school. Let's go.
Hey angels, so as you see, um, I'm cleaning my tools, okay? I'm getting ready for my clients. Uh, I'll be doing a silk press with a tint retouch today or color retouch today. Um, and I'm cleaning my tools as I always do before my client. I'm getting my proper uh, products and everything together so that when she gets here, we can start the service. Um, so at school, you know, they push for you to only use, you know, the Paul Mitchell products. And I do use Paul Mitchell products, but I use them in conjunction with things that I know are going to work for my client so that I can achieve the best result for them. So I do use outside products. However, you're not supposed to do that. That is considered contraband. Hopefully nobody at my school here, hears this because <laughs> I'm not supposed to be using outside products, but I do. Um, so with a service like the Silk Press, uh, you want to make sure that you have proper products, proper tools so that you can get the best outcome possible. Okay. And so that's what I like to do with my Silk Press client. She is a regular for me here at school. She comes and sees me about every four weeks. As you can see, this is her before. You see how straight her hair is. Um, she does nothing to her hair, okay? She comes and sees me every four weeks. So you, there are still good stylists out here that give that good old silk press that can hold you for that good two, three weeks. And I happen to be one of them, okay? She's a prime example of uh, what proper knowledge, proper product, and proper tools will do for the hair. Um, unfortunately, at school, we can't use the Marcel iron things like that if I was at home in my home salon um, she would definitely be a candidate for a Marcel a hot comb with the stove and a Marcel iron um, just to give her that max hole I am able to achieve that with proper products and a flat iron and electrical hot comb that I use at school okay so um, this is what the Lux silk press is all about now I'm currently giving you guys this voiceover as I'm driving to school, so hopefully the noise in the background is not too shabby. <laughs> okay, we wanna get this content out and I wanna get y'all, you know, involved. You, you've been asking to bring the vlog back and I'm still in school, so I, I wanna get you guys to see what a day looks like with me. All right, so here I am completing her tent retouch. She is a jet black client, so she wears a jet black color, a one in and we do great coverage. So we use a 1N plus a 20 vol for her formula, okay? And I put that all over and I let that process for about 40 minutes for complete gray coverage, all right? I'm gonna let you guys get into the video and yeah, I'll check back in towards the end. Okay, bye! have Miss Angela all rinsed out and as you can see here she is completely natural okay she is a textured client um, she does not have any chemicals in her hair outside of hair color um, she is heat trained she gets her hair heat pressed and have and have been getting it heat pressed for uh, a few years now so her hair is heat trained it responds to heat very very well However, understanding um, texture hair is of the other is of the utter importance, especially if the client is getting the hair silked or pressed out. Proper heat protectants are important because it's very easy to singe and burn textured hair. 
okay there's nothing like a good old blowout a good old silk press like we all love that but you have to understand you don't want to apply or overheat the hair so much without proper product that it doesn't return to its curly state okay if your hair is textured or you have a curl pattern and you're getting your hair straightened and you're losing your curl pattern or your hair is not reverting back to the original curl or coiled state then you have heat damage your hair is burned so you need to do a few things you need to number one educate yourself because you need to find products that work for you and number two you need to cut you need to cut your hair because once the hair is burned you can't do anything with it it's dead okay it's dead it has to go so a lot of ladies try to hold on to that hair when you're in the process of growing out a relaxer or you're in the process of um, you get a lot of um, the, the Dominicans they blow the hair out and it's a beautiful blowout but you have to be sure that you're getting someone that's not singeing your hair so if you're going to a Dominican you have these beautiful curls and coils or you're going to a stylist period and when you go to them, your hair curls up beautifully. You got those bouncy coils and curls, that beautiful texture. And then they do your hair and you go to wash it and it doesn't revert back. They burned your hair. It's, it's highly, highly probable that they have burned your hair. So the hair should always revert back. I've been doing her hair now for about four months. When she originally came to me, there was no damage. And as you can see, her hair reverts back to a beautiful curl pattern. So proper product and just understanding the hair type that you're dealing with is really, really, really important. And everything does not work for everyone, okay? Just because your last client was able to use that product on their hair doesn't mean that every client that you have is going to be able to use that product. So please, 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 um, angels, educate yourself. Um, having a licensed stylist does mean something you learn these things in school and hopefully you have a stylist that is licensed and has um, chosen to further educate themselves in the field okay it's very important i just wanted to talk about that so um use the heat protectant okay thank you <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
Yes, ma'am. If you gonna do a press, do a press, honey. Quality product, quality technique, quality tools will speak for itself, okay? This is the completed press of her hair. I go back in, I touch up her edges again. Um, and I might bump it a little bit more because some areas it was like bone straight and we wanted it to have a little bend on the end. But um, this is it. This is it from Kiki to Straight. And let me tell you, so a lot, in case you guys wanted to know, I use, so I'm old school and I do use a lot of old school techniques. Um, I prefer a press and comb. I prefer a Marcel flat iron. Um, for textured hair. However, like I said, when I'm at school, I can't use those things. So I have to improvise. Um, I do use high heat, but I use high healthy temperatures for the hair. Some hair is more coarse than others. She has a beautiful curl pattern. However, her hair would I would not consider her hair to be as coarse as some other clients that I um, do uh, have. So flat iron heat is good for her. Um, and that's what I use for her at school. She doesn't come and see me at my house. She comes to see me at school. So just again, understanding, I can't stress it. Bow just me. understanding product Pull knowledge. Up me. All those things. Pull up yeah. on me. It's the final results. Touch my tie hair coat out. I'll see you guys in the next Pull video. Y'all wanna pull up on me? Pull up on me.